morning everybody welcome to today's vlog so i'm about ready to get on a really exciting call um if you remember i always talk about ucb radio um and if you remember me talking about chloe chloe wilson she is um on ucb and she is really amazing and she has always just really supported our music and all of that she you know plays it on the station and has always reached out been really supportive and encouraging so she reached out uh, through email just uh, probably a couple weeks ago maybe last week and asked if i would want to be on a zoom call with her today just to kind of talk about the song our new song breakthrough that's out now and um so of course i said yes i would love to so in about uh, a little over five minutes i'm going to jump on this call with her so i'm in here in the baby's room i've got a light set up because <laughs> the lighting in here is not the greatest right now but um so yeah we're kind of hanging out in here it's gonna be really fun so yeah make sure again i always whenever i talk about it i try to link it in my uh, description below ucb radio even if it's a radio station in the uk but even if you're not in the uk it's not only in the uk actually last time i said that manny corrected me they have them other places but this particular one chloe she's with um the one in the uk and so anyway you can listen no matter where you are online my family listens i listen we really love ucb they have great music they have smart artists as well as well-known artists so anyway about to get on this call and i'm really excited hi hello how are you i'm good how are you good is baby moving quite a lot at the moment or yes he actually i just started being able to feel him move a little bit so that's been like the coolest thing ever so it's just a huge blessing huge miracle and it's nice to see you sort of face to face over zoom like this works with the time difference as well because you're like six hours behind us yes. or something crazy so so glad that we can make this work but rose there may be some people listening right now going Rosa Wookie, I recognize that name, or maybe they've never even heard your name before. So just start by telling us who you are, basically. Yeah, so obviously I'm Rose. Um, I am 25 and I actually live in Texas. Um, my husband and I are worship and tech pastors based here in Texas. So we get the incredible privilege of doing ministry here in Texas. And we've been married for a few years now and are actually expecting our first baby. Um, who is just a miracle baby. He is just, you know, we were told that we may never be able to have children. So it's just a real miracle. And we're just so, so grateful for this life that God has given us. So you are a, a worship pastor, as you just said then. Talk us through a little bit about how you got into music because that had to have started somewhere and now you're releasing songs, which is incredible. Tell us about that journey. Yeah, well, I actually started, I was really young. I was about six years old when I started in music. And it was one of those things I wasn't really too good at anything else. I wasn't into sports. I wasn't into any of the usual things. And so music just came to me and it was a little bit more naturally, you know, for me. And so I was just really excited about it and started going to a church that they asked me to kind of sing on their worship team at a really young age. And I just fell in love with it. And I just knew as soon as I started, you know, the first time I had gone into my church, I told my parents, you know, I'm going to be a worship leader someday. I want to do what that person's doing. It was a female worship leader and just really spoke to me. And I was just a kid. I didn't know what that meant. But I just said, I want to do that. And I really feel like God had spoken that into my heart, even at such a young age. And he has just opened doors that I have never even expected um, and just continues to do that. So it's been an incredible, incredible journey. And um, your latest song that we've added to the playlist is called Breakthrough. And this has become a real anthem in my heart, particularly over the past couple of weeks. Just talk us through the journey and the story behind writing that song. Well, thank you so much, first of all. You've been really so encouraging about the song. Um, but Breakthrough really is a song that my husband fully wrote on his own. So I have to give him credit there. I did not write the song, um, but he actually wrote it in the midst of our infertility journey. So we went through about a four year journey and we were still in the midst of it. I mean, we didn't see the end. You know, we didn't, we didn't have the breakthrough in that area yet. We were still believing for it. And so he came to me with this song and showed it to me. And it was just really, like you said, it became our anthem. You know, we needed that. We needed that declaration that, you know what, you're the God of breakthrough. And to me, it was exactly what I needed for just a kick in the face of the enemy, that he has no hold over me, over my family, over my future. And so we just sing it and declare it over ourselves. And so I hope that people can grab it 
as a declaration song that you don't have to sing it when you're on the other side. That's fine too. But also when you're in the midst of struggle, that's really the greatest time to declare that he is the God of breakthrough and your breakthrough is coming. And keep in touch as well. And as I said, I, I'm very genuinely excited to, to meet baby Awuku. Yes, thank you so much. We appreciate that so much. Have a great day. And you, my darling. Take care. You too. Bye. Okay, so that call this morning with Chloe from UCB was such a good one. So yeah, it was an amazing phone call. Um, it was a Zoom call. It's not really a phone call. Um, but I hadn't ever talked to Chloe before. That was the first time that we, I mean, I talked to her, but I'm talking about like, you know, that kind of talk like out loud on Zoom. And she was so sweet. She has been so sweet and so supportive of our music ever since they played our song Just One Touch way back whenever we were doing IVF. So it's been months and months ago. I have vlogs of that and she was just super supportive. Always had something good to say. And uh, still with Breakthrough, she's the same way. She's just been posting it on her own personal social media and things like that, just really going above and beyond. So we appreciate her so, so much. Um, but I did want to kind of show you guys, I'm going to film, kind of taking a total turn here, I am going to film a baby haul, a baby boy clothing haul. A lot of it is going to be gender neutral just because I just like a lot of neutral things, but um, I wanted to show you because I don't know how long this is going to be going on. And we went to Walmart yesterday, okay? And we were like, grocery shopping, but of course, I just talked about this on Instagram. I, of course, made a beeline for the baby clothes. That's just something that we do now, um, trying to get stocked up on things and not just doing it all at once, just trying to, I and mean, we've been trying to stock up since the very beginning, actually, since like maybe even before we were pregnant. I know I bought a pair of shoes before we were pregnant, but um, anyway, so Walmart is having, I guess people know about this and I just didn't know, but Walmart's having like an incredible baby sale. I don't know if it's for all kids clothes. I didn't go like to the toddler section or anything, but I know their baby clothes are like on major sale. So I wanna talk about just a couple things. I'm gonna show it in the haul, so I don't wanna show everything, but I wanted to show you just to give you a heads up in case maybe it's a short term thing and it's not gonna keep happening, although Walmart does always have amazing clearance on all of their clothes, even their adult stuff. It'll like randomly, something will be $3 in there and that happens like frequently, they always have clearance. So Walmart clearance is definitely always worth checking out, but this was just too good to pass up. Um, so we got these onesies, it's a three, piece onesie so this one says hello it's a little elephant um and we actually don't have a lot of onesies yet so we kind of actually need to pick some up these are six to nine months just trying to stock up on different sizes then this one in the back says daddy's little one it's again an elephant i like the neutral um but these are from the brand carters and um they are really nice and they were three for three dollars so basically these were a dollar each which obviously is really really good i'm trying to see if it shows a price of like what it was before the sale but i don't know can guarantee you more than three dollars um so yeah this is just really great they had all kinds of things we didn't spend more than three dollars on anything we got and we got a whole bag like i said i'll show it in the haul really soon i'm just waiting on some stuff to come in the mail and i want to show it all at once um, but I, I will show you two more things that I showed on Instagram. So, first of all, these little pants that are zero to three months. They do, my sister said they do too. They remind me of Flash. It doesn't say anything about Flash. They're brand uh, Dranimals. But they're like little lightning bolts. Like little joggers. They're so adorable. And they were $1. So, that just cannot be beat. Um, and then I got, we got this little onesie as well from Gerber. Six to nine months, that was like the main size they had left. But this is a Gerber Orga Organics and a Gerber Organic um, Modern Moments by Gerber. Um, and it's just this neutral color, one of my favorite colors. I just love this. And really super nice. It was $2. So really great sale i got a bunch of other things that was just like i think all the rest of it wasn't maybe two dollars maybe a couple more things for three dollars but just really awesome prices so if you or anybody that you know 
need baby clothes, definitely don't count Walmart out. They have amazing um, clearance stuff. Their clothes are great quality. They have really upped their quality of all of their clothes, I feel like, in the past few years. Everything is super nice. I was saying on Instagram, these are like dirt cheap kind of deals. Like this is like the store dirt cheap, not just the fact that it's cheap, but my favorite store is dirt cheap. And this is like what you would find in there. And so, yeah, just incredible. Definitely recommend checking it out. They had shoes, they had socks. I mean, all the accessories, almost everything for babies was on major clearance. So definitely wanted to give that a shout out before the haul. That way, if you're in need of some things, you moms or aunts or whatever can check that out. Good morning, guys. I look beyond rough this morning. This is real life you guys this is what i look like today and you know i show real life but manny's at the gym usually i would be but i did not get up in time today to go with him to the gym um when i did get up he had his shoes on and he said that i could i could still go if i wanted but i know him and he was it was 6 30 and he like he don't he doesn't like to go any later than that so I knew it would just be kind of putting him out, even though he, he wouldn't have acted that way, but it would have just been probably annoying to him. He's just pulling in actually, but I'm making him some breakfast because I thought I would be nice, especially since I missed the gym. <laughs> but um, I'm making some eggs and beans and bacon for him this morning. Um, I'm gonna have some too, obviously. So yeah, that's what we're doing. But I'm gonna wrap up this vlog um, so I can edit this and start a new one today because there's a fun, on today so i'll see you next time remember you're incredible jesus loves you we'll see you in the next one bye